Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to add Grammarly to Outlook. So, as you can see I'm using the um, Outlook 365 version that comes with the Office 365 and I guess you already know what is a Grammarly. Grammarly is an application that helps you to write and also right now it's using the AI and it's working really great. Don't bother with this uh, really bad sentence. I'm going to show you how Grammarly works uh, after I going to add it to my Outlook. So, uh, first of all, Grammarly has uh, two types of, <coughs> you know, you can use it for free and you can use it with a premium that comes with a subscription, but it also works, works great with um, the free version. So if you want to add this Outlook, the first of all, you need to go to this Grammarly uh, website, just, you know, in the Google search Grammarly and go to their website and then you need to log in or create the account. It's super easy to create an account, so I'm not going, I'm not going to, um, to bother you with this. So I'm just going to log in. And after logging in to your account or creating your account, I can save it. Uh, what you want to do is to go uh, in your main screen after logging to the applications and you want to install Grammarly for Windows. Uh, I have installed it earlier, but I have uninstalled it, so I will show you how it works. You just click here install, uh, the same like for, you know, here. Uh, I have downloaded the... Uh, the installator earlier so I'm not going to oh <laughs> I clicked it anyways so after downloading you just open the you know the Grammarly and you just want to install it as you can already see the Grammarly icon has come up to my desktop it should open right now in a moment. As you can see, the Grammarly has now opened and it launched uh, my browser to log in to uh, the Grammarly account so you can just continue to Grammarly and then just open Grammarly so it will bring you it will ultimately log you into the application and here is some you know tutorial how you can use it and you want to click continue for free or even upgrade to premium it's your choice I use it you know the free version and it's really really nice uh, now the Grammarly has opened us uh, another, you know, tutorial how it works. So you can check this out if you don't know. But I guess you know how Grammarly works. So let's just close it. We can close it completely. Now what you want to do is to restart the Outlook and make sure that the Grammarly is working. Is it working? Okay, let's open it, if it's not here. Okay, Grammarly is up and running, so that's okay. And now, when you're going, oh, not Google, the Outlook, when you're going to write an email, the Grammarly is going to work and pop up right here in this section. So maybe I will choose the draft because done some draft not to bother you fighting and after opening the Grammarly should uh, 
come up right here. So wait a moment. Oh, as you can see, it has come up right here. The first notification. So just, oh, as you can see, the Grammarly has already found eight mistakes and has, you know, light them up. So you can drag here and select that you should write hello with the spacer right here. And also, as you can see, you can click here and accept the correctness of Grammarly. So, accept, since also learn, accept, dismiss, accept, and using also accept, and also I'm just going to add delete the dot and you know just leave it as it is right now so this is it this is how you can add grammarly to your outlook and this is how it works so thanks for watching i hope this video helped you if it did Please hit a like and consider to subscribe to our channel. Bye!